across multiple countries, coordinated raids to smash one of Europe's biggest drugs rings. In Spain, France, Belgium, the Netherlands and the United Arab Emirates, 49 people were detained. They're all suspected of being members of a super cartel, believed responsible for supplying more than a third of Europe's illicit trade in cocaine. Among those arrested, a British man in Dubai, suspected of leading the crime group. He'd fled to the UAE from Spain, where he was also wanted for kidnap. Half a million euros were recovered across a number of properties. And at multiple locations, law enforcement uncovered the evidence of lavish lifestyles. Luxury living, which authorities say was funded by criminality. High-end homes, where the suspects lived and controlled the trade in drugs and money laundering. Garages stuffed full with expensive motorbikes. And elsewhere, luxury sports cars. There was, we're told, nothing discreet about the lives these suspects were living. The organised crime group is suspected of shipping cocaine from South America into Europe for distribution throughout the continent. The UK's National Crime Agency says the shipping routes across the Atlantic are constantly exploited by the criminal gangs. The majority of the production is in South America, Colombia, Peru, uh, and, and the routing from there en masse comes mainly through container ship, um, direct towards Europe, um, often into uh, the ports of either Antwerp or uh, Rotterdam and then on land over towards, towards the UK or staying on the container and coming into ports at the UK south. During more than 10 days of operational activity to dismantle this organised crime group, authorities say they seized more than 30 tonnes of cocaine. There's no doubt these raids are a major blow to the cartels flooding Europe with Class A drugs. But this is a highly lucrative trade that clearly funded luxurious lifestyles in multiple countries. Authorities are more than aware that other organised crime groups will soon attempt to exploit the gap in the market created by the dismantling of this super cartel. Mark White, GB News.